here are some words that you will need that will help you understand micrometers. The first word is caliper, veneer, measure and measurement. Caliper has two legs and is used to measure inside, internal, and outside, external sizes. Veneer. This gives you a smaller than one size. For example, 0 0.38 as you can see on the diagram. Measure. To measure is the action of finding the size of something using a tool. Measurement. The measurement is the unit to describe the size. For example, 25 millimeters or one inch. A micrometer or micrometer is a measuring tool and makes very fine measurements in metric and imperial. Metric sizes are in millimeters, centimeters and meters. Imperial sizes are in inches, feet and yards. Metric micrometers typically measure in 0 0.01 millimeter steps and imperial types in 0 0.001 inches. Typically. Other words for typically are generally or normally. Typically is used to say what normally happens. Types. Types are a group of things or people. The measurements micrometers show are more exact than other measuring tools such as veneer calipers or dial calipers. Exact means fully and completely correct or accurate. Here is a veneer caliper. It has a veneer scale that gives you a size less than one. It also has a caliper where it can measure internal and external sizes. This is a dial caliper. As you can see, it has the caliper to measure internal and external sizes, but it has a dial like a clock to give you the size less than zero. Micrometers are widely used in mechanical engineering for exact measuring of parts. Widely used means a large number of people use something. Mechanical engineering is the use of machines in industry. Most micrometers have two scales, a 
primary scale on the barrel or sleeve and a secondary scale on the thimble. Scale is a range of numbers that show the size, strength or quality of something. Primary is in the first place. Secondary is the second position. Here you can see a micrometer with the two scales. On the barrel or the sleeve is the primary scale and the secondary scale is on the thimble. To make the total measurement, combine the values from the primary and the secondary scales. Total is the result of adding two or more numbers. Combine is when you add something together. Value is the number you see on the scales. Some micrometers also have an additional veneer scale on the thimble which provides the user with more exact measurements. Additional is more than is usual or typical. Provide is to give something that is wanted or needed. A micrometer uses a calibrated screw on the spindle for measurement. Calibrated is something that is marked to make exact measurements. A spindle is a long thin pin. Every time the spindle makes a complete revolution, the space between the measuring faces of the micrometer the spindle and the anvil is adjusted by 0.025 inch or 0.5 millimeters. Revolution is a 360 degree turn. Space is an area that is empty or can be used. Adjust is to change something in a small way. Although micrometers are more exact than other types of caliper, they have a more limited range. Limited is when something is not complete or full. Range is a set of numbers that includes the highest and lowest possible. Micrometers typically have a measuring range of 25 millimeters and one inch. For example, metric types measure 0 to 25 millimetres, 25 millimetres to 50 millimetres, 50 millimetres to 75 millimetres, and so on.
and imperial types measure 0 to 1 inches, 1 to 2 inches, 2 to 3 inches, and so on. There are a number of different micrometers. The most common are outside micrometers. Inside micrometers and depth micrometers are also widely used. Depth. Depth is the distance from the front of something to the back or below a surface or far inside something. 